here's a video of my um, Rocketronics ELS installation as you can see I've got the um, pulleys and belts and stepper all behind the, um, the cow where the change wheels used to be um, up here is a box with all the electric gubbins in and this is the control stepper motors there for the cross slide um, I've done quite a few tests after commissioning it so um, I'm about to do the first first cut on it you'll have to excuse the camera wobbling because I'm holding it in my hand but um, <coughs> what I'm going to do I've already faced it off more or less um, that um, piece of aluminium that's in there is 15.88 mil I'm going to turn it down to 12 mil over a length of 12 mil so I need to take 388 off it which I need to half so that's 150 uh, 194 I think that's right, 194. Um, 8, 9, 18, yep. Yeah. 194, so we'll switch on and um, see how we do. What we need to do is, um, can I get a better picture? I don't know if I can get a decent picture of the, of the control panel. Uh, maybe turn that light off, see if that makes any difference. Uh, no, if anything, it's worse. So let's put the main light on, see if that helps. Don't know whether you can see that or not, but hopefully you can. Um, so I've got it set on turning, and it's on a, a feed rate of... Um, 0.2 per revolution. Um, I'm going to set that on 12 and then we go down and set that on uh, and by the way I should say it should be minus 12 because everything whether you're going X or Y uh, X or Z it needs to be minus so I've put that on X, um, that needs to be 194 is 1, oh, uh, perhaps I need to press that do I, oh, that's going to be fun then, isn't it? Uh, no, wrong way. get there in a minute one eight one nine four <coughs> um, I need to need to move the um, need to move the um, cross slide in a little bit let me change lights so you can see what's going on X uh, y, Z is already set on zero because I've just faced the end off apart my little, very little bit um, I need to zero um, the uh, the X I'm, I'm doing this all from um, Right, that's zeroed, so then we put um, X on zero, start the lathe, press start, it's going to do four revolutions taking 0.46 off and then one taking 0.1 off over 12 mil, so 
let's see what happens. Seems to be doing it quite nicely. I haven't got the speed too high purposely for the first test. And this should take the final cut off. You can alter the um, the speed of the final cut so it can go slower and faster. So that seems to be successful. If you have a look, it's taking some quite um, long turns off off the aluminium, but we'll um, turn it off, and uh, it feels very smooth actually. Let's have a, a measure and see what we're at. Hopefully, that should be 12 mil. Let me just put the camera down a minute. Well, it says 12.49, so we need to, um, I think I haven't got the settings for the backlash exactly right because it's 0.49 over what it should be um, and it does compensate for that but for the first cut so I'm, I'm very pleased with that thank you very much okay I've adjusted the, um, the backlash a bit more I've checked it again and yeah I didn't have it quite right so we'll see what happens now this time I'm gonna um, Turn it down to 11 mil. <coughs> That's minus 11 mil. Um, and it's two four twelve four nine. So we'll take another one four nine off, or say one fifty. Um, so that's. 0.75 on X oh, wrong one go down to X point um, still working out how to do it myself so Right, that's point seven five, so that's on Z. It's going to be, take it down eleven mil, so not quite um, to the end, um, because that was exactly twelve mil, which is nice. Um, so I've got that bit right. Um, we want naught on the X, um, so I'm going to take this, take it down to eleven mil. Turn it down to 11 mil um, over one and a half mil. So we'll fire it up and see what happens this time. X is way too short. Oh, because I've gone. I forgot. It's got to be minus, isn't it? Ooh, I'll get there in a minute. Minus. 7.5 or 0.75 should I say that should be better now I must get that in my head that um, 
it needs to be minus all the time. I'm going to take two at 0.32 and then one at one mil. Press start again. Right, let's measure that and see how we're doing. Well, I don't even grumble at that, can you? Eleven point oh one. Think that's close enough. So that's good and the finish is very smooth you can see little ridges in it but you can't feel them with your nail very nice i'm very pleased with that i can't do any threading yet because um i've not um i've not ground any threading bits yet but uh Now it looks to be pretty much on 11mm as well. I'm pleased with that. Thank you very much.